Well, the perfect game tournament brought hundreds of little leaguers to Southeast Texas. However, only a few played today to call themselves champions. I got an early start to my day over at Ford Park Fields for the 9U Piranhas against the 8U Coburn Wildcatters. Starting us off, Blake Howard for the Wildcatter. He ripped one down the middle, misses two gloves or an RBI, and Howard is off first base, though. Here he is. The ball's going to come back, and the Piranhas, they get their out. Now it's the Piranhas' turn to get something going. Parker Evans hits one up to left field. It's right above that line, and Jace Vanderbilt for the Wildcatters follows that ball right to his glove. And back to those catters, Ethan Dunham gives one to right field. He'll get a base hit, but the Piranhas are looking for a play at home plate, and catcher Madden McFadder completes it, and that runner's out. Wildcatters catching some fire at bat. Bo Arsenault hits one back to that fence for a two-base hit, Brian Dunham. And you've got to see just little man's celebration over at second. Look at him go. <laughs> well, those piranhas, they're falling behind. Grayson Spencer is fighting back. He blasts one to the left fence. The Wildcatters throwing it back in. But Spencer, he's going to slide to second and gets a two-base hit. Unfortunately, though, for those piranhas, they couldn't catch up to the Wildcatters. The Wildcatters move on with an 11-7 win over the piranhas and would later go on to beat Texas Freight 12-3 in the championship game.